Hey there, you've heard me talk about a special experience that I've had in my life, and I remember the day that somebody suggested that I run the Olympic torch for the Coca-Cola company, and they said they wanted a few celebrities, myself, Tom Izzo, and there was a TV news person at the time in Lansing. They got to run it as well, and I said, I don't even know if I can do that. And then throughout the process, found out that, yeah, indeed, I was going to have to do that, and I was going to have to run. So, um... I got all signed up. I got the whole outfit. They decked me out from top to bottom with official Olympic gear. And they get you all ready for this. And then all of a sudden, you're kind of on your leg of the journey. And I was totally unprepared for what happened next. I looked down the road and saw a person coming to me. And they told me the story of how this gentleman that was going to hand me the Olympic flame was able to carry the torch. He had suffered a brain injury when he was on a biking accident and it was just learning to walk, let alone run again. So he's coming toward me with the Olympic flame and I burst out crying, <laughs> of course, because it was such a moving event. I felt totally unworthy to carry this thing, but this is it. This is the official Olympic torch and uh, people always ask me, why there's no flame in it. They actually ask you to take the flame out and uh, they, uh, they unlight it so that you can't have it, but you can always have this. Now this is the second globe that's on this because um, it met a ceiling fan oh. at one point. So uh, the globe has been replaced, but the memories will live on forever. And I'm so excited to get to carry the official, official Olympic flame that's now in Sochi. So go Team USA.